This is the sky trough. We've avoided the use of heavy, relatively expensive glass mirrors. We've completely eliminated that prior generation of technology by going to a lightweight, inexpensive, and unbreakable reflective film. Skyfuel developed the film called Reflectech that lines the solar trough. The materials were tested at the National Renewable Energy Lab outside Denver, Colorado. And this is the film that makes the mirror on the collector. And the secret ingredient, it's not all that secret, is silver. And silver happens to have a really good match with sunlight for reflectance. And really, this is the catalyst that's allowed the design of this collector to be so novel and make such great improvements over collectors of the past. The reflective film has allowed us to take a fresh look at the design of the trough and in many ways we reinvented the technology. The trough tracks the sun during the day. The reflective film redirects the sun's rays into a double layered tube in the center of the trough. What it does is it concentrates the light up to that receiver tube where the energy is, is captured and gathered, turned into heat that is used to produce steam, that is then in turn turned into electricity through a conventional steam turbine. It produces about 150 kilowatts of electricity, which is probably enough to power, say, 75 to 100 homes. We've designed this technology with the idea of large-scale, utility-sized solar power plants. So the idea is to capture the sun in a large way, deploy it in a very large scale, produce electricity that can be fed into the utility grids. It's such an abundant resource, and it arrives at the Earth for free. And, um, it can be harvested efficiently and cleanly. The lowering of the solar energy cost, of course, is, is a key part of the whole solution. That's what we've been focusing on, and that's why we've developed uh, an innovative approach. This is a technology that can be implemented very quickly, very scalable, doesn't require exotic materials. It builds on our labor force within the United States, will create many, many, many jobs. It's all right here at our hands. We just need to move forward and implement it.